Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg, and that is a backdraft Cobra, baby. She is sweet. 427 stroker under the hood. We got the perfect number on there, number 98. Probably one of the most winniest uh, Cobras out there. Love the stripes on it. Now, this may look like it doesn't have any metallic in it, but I'm telling you, there's about four or five different colors of metallic in that paint, and it is looking sweet. It's got the clear bra on it here. It's got the iconic 427. I already told you it's an RT4, so it's got the new suspension out back. She is just looking absolutely gorgeous. And listen to this baby purr, baby. It's just cool as can be. With the 18 inch rims on it, We've got Carol Shelby signed it right here on the door. The interior on it is just gorgeous. We got the wood steering wheel. We got that five speed shifter in there. We got the four point harnesses. I'll tell you, I cannot wait to get this baby out on the road. Whenever we go to a car show, man, I'm getting in a Cobra. She is looking sweet. The stance on it's killer, and man, just listen to this thing purr. Tell you what, you just get out and fire this baby up in your garage and just listen to it. We got the fuel fill that they used to use back in the day when they were racing these things. Just looking absolutely gorgeous. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we don't do any consignment whatsoever. So that means that we own every one of our vehicles here at Vanguard. So we spend the time to check them out before we buy them. Let's look, open up the hood here and take a look. We gotta check out this 427. Look at that baby. Isn't that sweet? It's got power brakes, power steering. It's that Windsor based motor that they stroke out to 427 to get all that horsepower, guys. So give Tom a call, 248 974 9513. We're gonna go drive this baby. Drive a Cobra. Let's go. Tell you what, sounding amazing, driving amazing. Just love these cars, man. Nothing more fun than driving go karts on the road. Really, really fast go karts. I tell you, she is a blast. Hey, there's a Cadillac convertible, and hey, that looks like one of our mechanics out doing a test drive. Now, we can ship this baby anywhere in the world and we can help you finance it. Call Tom anytime and he will hook you up. Tell you what, love going through the gears on these babies. Tremec makes such a badass transmission for them. Of course, I'm just touching the accelerator. I don't want to go to jail. This thing is fast as can be, man. It's absolutely a blast to drive. Now, this is the big and tall uh, version. The, floor box is actually lowered down, so you got more room for your legs. I actually had to scoot the seat up about three inches on this. I'm six foot tall, and I had to scoot the seat up to reach the pedals. So you guys that are a little bit taller than me, no problem whatsoever driving this baby. Now you can see down here on the dash, everything is right where you need it. Real easy to see, of course everything brand new. Looks like uh, 2,382 miles. She is just a hoot to drive, man. Just love it. Just, I mean, just as easy as can be. Now, a lot of guys don't like the power steering, but I tell you what, sure makes it nice and comfortable to drive, especially when you're in tight spaces. Now, we're very close to the airport here in Detroit. So if you'd like to come visit us, we'd love to have you. We do sell most of our stuff sight unseen on the net, so we don't get to meet a lot of our customers. So please, if you've got the time and the means, come on, visit us, we'd love to have you. We got a semi truck back in here in front of us. Brakes feel great on it, the shifter feels great. I mean, drive straight down the road, no problem whatsoever. Like I said, you will get more attention with this baby. Pull in a gas station, you better have a minute because there's going to be some people want to know something about your car. So we're going to put this baby up in the air for you right now so we can show you just how nice the bottom side is. 
We do that on every car here at Vanguard. So stick with us. We're going to do that for you right now. All right, we're underneath this Cobra now. Man, it is pretty under here. Of course, you got your tie downs. And if you watch my videos all the time, I tell you not to use these. Drive this, mother. You'll have a lot more fun. You can see it's got the new upgraded suspension that the RT4s have on them. It's fully adjustable and it is a monster. We got the uh, 8.8 .8 rear end here. Uh, it is a 350 gear. Or actually, this says 355. Uh, and of course, limited slip. You can see the frames all nicely painted, beautifully welded up. All these cross members are removable, which is super cool. Uh, if you need to take the transmission out, real easy to do. You know, early on these Cobras, when they built these suckers, these cross members weren't removable, and the only way to take the trans out if you needed to is take the whole body off. Well, this is cool. Very, very easy fix. A T5 trans, that's a five-speed trimming, hydraulic clutch, uh, explosion-proof bell housing. We got great big old uh, extra capacity oil pan in here. It looks like we got a temperature sending unit in there also. And of course, it's got the BMW suspension up front. We got the power rack and pinion steering up front, uh, struts holding up the front. Uh, we got disc brakes up front, disc brakes out back. Uh, we got a big electric fan here, uh, keeping that radiator cool. And again, we got a couple of tie downs here, and I'm telling you, don't use them, drive this sucker. <laughs> Um, the nose is very close to the ground, so make sure you don't curb this thing. Um, of course, only the mice are going to be able to see it because it's only about that far off the ground. Um, now, a lot of people get confused. Let me come back to these bumperettes real quick. A lot of people get confused. They think that something is missing here, but this is what they look like. They had that quick jack that came underneath here and lifted them back in the day, and those are to look just like back in the day. Now, we do have some clear bra on the front. And we do have the uh, real knockoff rims. Now this is a center locking cap. That spins up first, it's got your arrow on it. And then you've got your tire wire. And the tire wire on these is just there for looks. And to tell you how to get these off, you hear that big old slam? That's what you do. You hit them with a big old lead hammer, but you knock them off towards the front. If you're on the passenger side or the driver's side, knock them off towards the front of the car. Now you can see those stainless side pipes all shined up looking good, that 98 on the side. That was one of the most winning cars back in the day, number 98. Got good looking wheels back here. Of course, these are the GT40 style wheels. I forgot to tell you the size of the front tires. I'll go back up there. These are 295 4018s. Let me run over here and take a real quick look. Just love the look of this car, man. She looks like a race car. 245 40 18s up front. Well, we're going to lower this sucker down and take a look at that 427 stroker under the hood. All right, we're under the hood of this baby now, and I tell you what, she's looking sharp under here with all this aluminum, those tall valve covers, 427 Cobra on them. Now, this 427 is a small block. They start out with a 351 Windsor base motor, then they put the stroker kit in it. Um, which makes it 427 cubic inches. And I tell you what, back in the day, if Mr. Shelby could have used this motor, this would have been the motor he'd have been using. Uh, we've got MSD distributor, MSD uh, coil, uh, serpentine belt setup on it. The car does have power steering. You can see the uh, power steering pump here and the reservoir here. I love the way these guys do these hard pipes here for the radiator hoses, top and bottom. Then they got these high pressure hoses going down here to the uh, rack and pinion setup. This is the overflow tank for the uh, radiator. You can see the aluminum uh, intake. That is an Edelbrock intake there. Looks like we got a Holly carb sitting on top. It's a 770. Um, looks like, uh, let's see. Yep, only a single pumper. It is dual feed though. So 770 um, CFM on that thing. Uh, you can see the power booster here, so you do have power brakes, steering shafts all chromed up looking good. I mean, everything about this car is sweet, man. I love the color, love the stripes, love the motor, love the car, guys. She's an RT4. She's ready to go. Give us a call, 248-974-9513, and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this stream in your drive.